Welcome everybody to this uh, session on uh, natural building materials. And this eighth session will be on building with strobel. Uh, and I am happy to host uh, Thomas Brave that will uh, present one of his uh, one of his building in France that has been insulated with strobel. And I was really happy that uh, Thomas could come and present uh, this building because usually we see a lot of strobel buildings that would be one or two story with a, a timber frame structure. But this one is really much more conventional type of building like a reinforced concrete building with exterior uh, strobel insulation. So that will be very interesting to see such kind of building uh, here and how he could build this. So thanks a lot again, uh, Thomas, to, to come to this uh, presentation and to speak with us. Um, so I forgot to present Thomas, but as most of the presenters that came to these uh, sessions, I just, I, we never met, I just researched on strobel construction and I found by chance his building. So the best is that Thomas could introduce himself. I only know that he's architect and specialized in such ecological construction. So please, Thomas, it's- Okay, hello everybody. So my name is uh, Thomas and I am uh, living in France in Grenoble. I studied uh, 20 years ago in Strasbourg, in the north of France, and now I'm, li I'm living in the Alps. Uh, I used to, to, to work with uh, other architects uh, in wood construction and at the beginning of my uh, professional experience, and now I'm uh, building uh, with my own uh, structure, with my own uh, office, uh, wood construction with straw bale or uh, earth or... I, I use every material, but uh, I try to, to develop um, natural building, natural uh, material in my building's construction. Uh, so uh, one of these building is uh, that I will... Uh, show you the, the plans and the pictures is uh, an office building for um, the community of uh, La Vallée de la Drôme. It's, uh, I, I can show you the, it's, it's a two, 2030, uh, was in a, seven years ago, and now it's built, uh, the, 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 the design starts uh, seven years ago, and uh, the building is, uh, is finished, since three years ago. So this is the, I, I just, uh, to, to, to introduce, I show you the, the, the place where you are and the place where I built the, um, this building. I designed actually, I, I didn't build it, but uh, the, so this is a zoom on the square, red square. Um, this is the Grenoble where I live and when I uh, work. And the project is uh, in this valley uh, from the east to the west. Uh, it's a very nice valley, very green with a nice river. And uh, the, um, the community is the community of uh, all the um, people living in this area along the river. The, the river is here. It's a, the name of the river is Drôme and uh, the place the sites where we where the the office um, take place is uh, in the middle of uh, this um, activity area. Okay. So this is the um, the building from the from the sky. When we arrive, the building doesn't exist. Only this building was existing. It's a place where people. Uh, the young, young, um, oh, it's a new uh, people who like to start a new, uh, new project, professional project, used to uh, to take place for a few years in the beginning of their uh, their uh, professional uh, experience, and then they leave for another place. 
and we our building is a, is a kind of square. I can show you the, this is a this is the building. The first first building was uh, that was uh, existing before, and uh, our building was uh, the site was just next to it, and it was uh, like a I don't know if you can say a, an extension of this of of it. So that's the we can see the, the place here. So um, we you can see the connection between the old building and the new one. The new one is um, um, the the question of the the the, 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 the community was um, was asking for me to design a building of um, more or less uh, 1,500 uh, square meters for a 70 person or 80 person to work in it. And uh, they asked me, uh, it needs to be ecological, but very, very, um, um, I say very cheap. It, it doesn't, doesn't be, it doesn't, uh, they didn't have a lot of money. And they asked us to make a very cheap building, but it was it, it needs to be ecological as much as possible. So with my uh, my economist, we propose um, a square building with um, a concrete uh, structure, reinforced concrete, and uh, the 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 envelope was uh, by, in wood with straw bale. It was a um, okay. Okay, I'll show you the plan and then, then the, the cuts and the, the elevation. Uh, you can see here the, the, the offices are like a U shape with a terrace uh, in the middle. To another, another, another um, demand or no, ask uh, the, 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 off, the, uh, the client, we say the client. Yeah. Uh, ask us to have um, also um, conviviality. I don't know if you if you conviviality. Yeah, it's okay. Conviviality. Though. So the center of uh, of the building needs to be a, a gathering place where people can eat and and uh, meet each other. So the, you can see the plan. It is a it's a normal building with a corridor and uh, office in the north, office in the south. So we prolong, we we connect the building with uh, with with uh, ours with this uh, corridor and uh, this little uh, offices, uh, the one uh, next to the other, with a, a unique um, only one uh, staircase, very wide, and a place for a elevator, but. Uh, we didn't need to, to put one because uh, there is already one in the existing building. Here is for the, the, the technical lo local. Um, for the, technical rooms, yeah. Technical, yes. This is the first floor. No, first floor was the ground floor. Uh, we say first floor. Or first floor is ground floor is the same. Second floor and third floor. Um, you can see on the on the on the cuts that the, for example on this one that the the structure is in concrete the black uh, black lines and the insulation not not this one but the, on the facade are in wood with straw bale in it you can you I'll show you the the details but you can see here the 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 the, the, the structure uh, principles. Here you can see the, the underground uh, for the for the archives, the place for the for the elevator, and the connection to the to the existing building. That was the plan, and that was the detail. You can see uh, detail from. Uh, from the engineer, uh, you can see the 
the concrete structure and the facade in straw bale with when it's uh, it's very simple the facade is um, is all square uh, windows uh, the one on top of each other when it's when it's um, you can see here the windows and uh, the the wall and this is one uh, one one we can see module or what is the name for the um, a piece of facade? Yeah, a module. A module. Uh, this well, is one, uh, one full module and one module here with uh, windows. So there is only two modules. So this uh, is the module with windows, with three windows. Excuse me, and uh, one full module uh, when it's when it's only a wall. You can see. The connection for on the concrete and um, this uh, is inside is wood there is a um, uh, say um, on dit, in a, in a, a par vapeur uh, uh, pas de, y a pas de, c est, c est... membrane ouais. uh, what, what, uh, vapor permeable membrane yes to protect the straw bale and the outside is um c'est de l'enduit alors l'enduit je sais pas non plus comment on dit the plaster plaster okay plaster mm -hmm. okay and uh, three layers of plaster outside to protect it so it's very simple for the facade and this is uh, a piece of wood that um, permit to protect uh, the windows uh, from the sun and uh, it, it, it's, it, it permits it's a protect also the, the the plaster from the from the from the rain and uh, there is the um, on say the les, les volets c'est comment uh, shutters shutters les coulissants les coulissants uh, sliding shutters sliding shutters to 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 move So next uh, next uh, picture is at the end of the concrete. Uh, you can see the the skeleton skeleton or should I say skeleton yes skeleton of the building. It's very simple. There is two offices in each uh, each square, each each rectangle. We can see the, the here the, the staircase in concrete also for the for the acoustics. So you can you can you can make a double um, a double uh, office or a simple or two simples. And on on uh, on this skeleton you can uh, during the, during the building of this skeleton the the carpenters are building the the modules. So they buy some straw bale for uh, the filling from the valley. So it's local. Um, and now it's already the, the little movie. Okay, you can see the a little movie from the from the carpenter. Is it uh, enough? Yeah, it's just a time lapse mm. of the wood box full with uh, with straw bale, and then the. On the membrane, membrane, and then it's uh, it's uh, they, they put it outside of the um, so that's um, first uh, before they are checking the um, the moisture or the the humidity, yes, moisture, humidity, humidity of uh, the trobe to 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 be sure that it's uh, real really um, dr um, dry dry. Well, it's, this is the the little um, tool they use to to uh, make sure it's uh, really uh, uh, com uh, compressed. Compressed, yes. Compressed. This is a straw bed. You can see just the picture and the module, uh, the wall module. Ah, 
Qu'est-ce que c'est que ça Voilà. Et là, le window module. It was um, less than one kilometer from the from the concrete building, from the real building. It was just next to it, mm. by chance. And that that's the 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 module ready to to be. Um, to, comment dit uh, levé? Uh, uh, installed. Installed, ouais, levé, ouais. Et la grue, on dit comment la grue ou le camion crane. Crane. crane, crane, with the crane. So let's go for the, you can see this module and the other uh, covering the wood, the concrete structure. So it's, it's like a, completely um, covered by paper, but uh, it was to protect from the rain. And after that, They are cutting the paper for the to put the windows. You can see the here the the crane. And the people walking. You can see the straw bale uh, re, uh, here under the um, under the paper. Here again. The windows and after it's the plaster with a reinforcing uh, on the junction between two modules and a, a special junction and a normal uh, metal grid to reinforce the plaster and here uh, you can see the plaster on the on the straw bale what type of plaster uh show Lime, lime plaster. Okay. Lime plaster. Very um, classical uh, technique for the people. No, it's even more simple than a, than a, a wood uh, covered. And here, normally there is a little uh, a movie from the. Maybe I could just cut the the sound. It's the. Kind of a promotional uh, movie from the from the client, from the community. Where you, well, you can see the the building uh, growing. So the, the um, you can see the concrete. Another um, particularity is uh, everything is. Uh, we would like to to have on, only. Um, Comment on dit, matériau brut? Uh, raw material. Raw material. So wood and concrete are all of them uh, raw at the end. We try to not not to cover every everything by a plaster or or uh, comment on dit les plaques de plaques les plaques de plâtre à l'intérieur. Uh, gypsum board. My gypsum board or all the second. Uh, Second hand, je ne sais pas comment pas second hand, mais le, 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 le second œuvre. On a limité le second œuvre, c'est ce qu'on appelle ça. Uh, the finishes. They, they, finishes. they ouais. try to have as finishes. less uh, finishes as possible. Only working with, uh, with raw materials in, mm. uh, on, the, on the inside of the building. You can see, the, you can see the, all the technical uh, installation, like the. La, la ventilation et l'électricité sont visibles à l'intérieur. All the <coughs> electric pipes and ventilation pipes are visible from inside also. From inside. This is the shutters. They, they would like to have a low tech, low tech. Uh, Low tech building. Well, this is a blow uh, test to test the uh, air, uh, the air proofing of the building. Eighty six. So there are 86 people working in this building. 
with uh, 200 square meter on ground and mm -hmm. 1,400 meter uh, surface of offices. There are 36 tons of straw that has been used inside. Uh, that was the, the end of the uh, the end of the of the building with the, the the celebration at the end. And here I I'll show you just a few pictures of the Finnish building. So the wooden uh, windows and doors. Shutters horizontal on the south and vertical on the north, all manual. They didn't want some. Uh, they didn't. They didn't want electricity. Um, electrical uh, shutters to responsibilize the, the the people. So this is here the 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 main uh, the main place where they gather. All the, um, on dit les élus, je sais pas comment on dit les élus. Euh, on va pas dire comme ça. De... Ah, what was it? The, 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 the people from the municipality. Yes. This is the, the terrace. The inside, so you can see the the concrete uh, staircase with the wooden uh, finishings, the acoustics uh, on the walls and uh, the pipes, the visible pipe pipes on the on the ceilings. So this is uh, an office with concrete uh, wall, uh, raw concrete, raw wood. You cannot see the straw bale because you, you there is too, there, there, there will be too uh, too dangerous and too um, uh, for a, for a public uh, office. Um, a corridor. They, they told us that they always uh, walk with uh, the windows open. <laughs> okay. This is the main uh, main uh, room with the heating and the acoustics in the the, the, the metal um, panels and the lighting. It's not very high. The the the, the ceiling is quite um, low, quite uh, close to the people. Mm. You see also the ceiling is uh, in, in concrete, raw concrete. And you can see here the, the little uh, piece of wood that permits to, to the facade to, to, to be fixed to the concrete. By night. And that's it, I think. Yes. I think it's the last uh, last picture. So now I can maybe answer to the, the students. Yes. So th yeah. Thanks a lot, Thomas, for this presentation and showing this building to, to us. It's really nice. And I'm sure students had a lot of questions. And uh, Damla, one of the students, her microphone is not working, so she wrote in the chat is asking why do we need to compress the straw belt to use it in the in the in the in the walls so it's um to avoid to have some air in the straw belt for the fire because if you have a it, it could be uh if, if the straw belt is very compressed you the, the fire cannot uh, uh, burn the the, the bale and uh, it's because it's uh, the, the material is uh, delivered in bale and not uh, en vrac. Je sais pas comment on dit en vrac. Uh, not loose. Not loose. You can you can buy it like that. Okay. 
and it's also better for the for the um, the anim even the maybe if there is some animals who want to 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 come into into it they cannot if it's very compressed they cannot uh, go through and uh, also the um, it's better for the for the most moisture too okay. and it's very and also it's uh, it's a bit uh, bit more easy to 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 uh, to put the one to each, uh, next to each other it's like bricks Okay, thanks. Uh, another question came in the chat uh, about uh, if it was difficulties, uh, if it was difficult of the during the process of the project. So I don't know if uh, Begum is speaking about the design or the construction. Could you precise, please, uh, Begum, if it is about the design or the construction? You could even open your microphone for asking your question. During the construction, was it difficult to no, use the base during the construction? Not really. We have a good, uh, good, how uh, do uh, Companies. Good companies. A good, a uh, bon mason. Alors mason, c'est mason. Mason, oui. Yeah, good mason. A good uh, carpenter. A good. Uh, uh, every, everyone was uh, more. Uh, we have a, we had a good choice, a good ch a good chance, and um, the only the only problem we have is um, the l'étancheur, l'étanchéité, uh, the waterproofing, waterproofing on the of the of the um, concrete uh, sailing are not very good, but it's not a problem. It's a casual problem in every building. It's not a special problem of this building. But the thing is, uh, because of the water is very dangerous for the straw bale, it's a, it's a special um, stress we have on this building. Okay. But uh, we, we, have, we make some uh, control and the, the straw bale is, uh, is dry. And so could you manage to uh, keep it low cost? Also yes, we manage. It's, um, we are really, really. We have a really low cost uh, building. Uh, I don't know if 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 it's very interesting to to talk, to tell you uh, the cost, but it's uh, <laughs> one thousand and two hundred and fifty euros per square meter, and in France it's very uh, very cheap. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thanks. And um, about uh, Damla is also asking about the fire. Is there anything special to prevent fire in the base? Uh, in this kind of building, not very much. It would have been more, much more difficult for uh, for uh, housing projects because in house in a house you can sleep and then you cannot uh, leave the building in a few minutes. So in France, in the housing projects you have to make a, you have to to put a special um, fire uh, protection inside the straw bay and uh, for the offices because you can leave the building in a few minutes um, you don't have to put this uh, protection so so there is no law um, avoiding this kind of construction in France, but very, they make some uh, some some um, some. Uh, on the, on the, they say they try the tests. The test some tests. on this kind of building to to try to 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 check if it's burning very fast or not, and uh, the tests are showing that uh, it doesn't burn. The straw bed doesn't burn if it's really uh, dense and. Uh, if it's uh, not so loose, okay. it's burning only the few um, the few um, straw on the big of the surface are burning, but it's it's stopping very quickly. Okay, thanks a lot. Uh, is there any question? Anyone else has, does have any question? I have a question. 
Yes, uh, Thank you for presentation. Uh, so I want to ask about also about cost. So did you have a compare uh, with if you make this building with a conventional insulation material with same U value with the strawberry panels? Uh, what's the comparison of the cost of if you use the strawberry panels and if you use uh, the same U value uh, strawberry panels? Uh, sorry, in, in, conventional in, insulation material. Like, uh, like, uh, rock wool, wool. Uh, from that. Uh, yeah, like the same ULU with these panels. This one is really highly insulated, but let's think about the same uh, installation uh, properties with the same this strawberry panels, but you use, like, uh, as you say, is like a, uh, wool. rock wool, the end of the roche. Yes. The comparison um, of cost, like. I think because this building was very uh, standard, uh, very um, regular uh, and well uh, well uh, studied by the by the, the architect and the engineer, the um, the building doesn't cost much than uh, conventional because the trouble is very cheap. It, it, it's almost uh, free. It's not free, but it's. Uh, it, it's very cheap. It's a, it's a, usually it's a, it's it is burning or or just composting. It's not a it's not a, a high um, value uh, material. So it makes some economy. I think it, it permits to have the same price than uh, that, that uh, compares to a rock pool uh, building. Our economists uh, said uh, at the, at the, in the first uh, hours of the studies, he said, with this price, we couldn't do anything else than rock pool and metal and PVC uh, building. And at the end, he recognized that uh, we managed to make, uh, at the same price, a wooden straw bale uh, building, much better for, for insulation and much better for, for environments. Okay, thanks. Um, Gizem, is Gizem is surprised about the, the cost. She's asked, she finds it that it is low, co low cost. This is as asking it was all uh, included the cost you gave to us. Yes, no, it's not included um, uh, the parking place with the photovoltaic. Uh, Covered, okay. but the building is really uh, it's all included. All, all included. There is no the um, all the when you when you say uh, when you talk about a price, you don't give the the price of the in France huh, in one thousand two two hundred and fifty. There is it's it's there is no taxes, no no. Um, uh, the surroundings, the, all the effects, the, um, the pavement and the trees uh, are not inside, are not in the price. All the furniture is not in it. It's only the building and not the studies. There is no, the, the, the architects and the engineering um, are not included. It's only the building. The, be the no, construction. Only the construction with no taxes. If you put all the, the other, it, it, it depends how you do you count in, uh, in Turkey. This is a good question that I cannot answer. Mm -hmm. In France, it's always like that, that you compare a building to another, you have to, you, you only you take the, you take this, uh, you try to simplify a maximum the, the cost. Because some some of them are very have different taxes, some of them are have a garden, and some of them are have not a garden, and so you keep only the. It, it's in we say hors tax par mètre carré. So so. Uh, so the price is with, without taxes per square meter of yes. uh, built area. <laughs> okay. Um... There's a question, but Damla, I really don't understand exactly what do you want to ask? 
about the effect of sustainability. So maybe do you want to ask if there is less need of ventilation, cooling and heating because of using straw better? I guess it should be something like this. Um... Yeah, I think the question of Damla is if using straw bell uh, prevent to use so much uh, heating system and uh, cooling system. Hmm. It's true that the straw bell is a 36 uh, centimeters uh, insulation. So in the summer and in the winter, it's a real cool, uh, a real good um, envelope protection from the the cold and from the heat. So it avoids uh, climatization. Um, also the concrete uh, make like a, it, 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 it is a, um, the concrete stay cool in the summer and stay warm in the winter. Thanks to this uh, straw bale envelope, very thick. So there is no less needs of heating, less needs of uh, cooling. And also uh, the straw bale is a, a good material because it needs a very, very few energy to, to make it compared to rock wool that needs to, uh, to be heated at very high uh, temperature to be, to be, to be fabric, uh, to, be, uh, to be made. And also to to be transported to the to the working sites, the straw bed is coming from close closer. Okay. Can be can be come from closer. Okay, thanks a lot. I have a more technical question yes. uh, about about those panels, uh, the straw bed panels. Are they uh, self-supporting or are they attached to the concrete i mean to the structure the straw bed is um, is um, just um, on dit serré, uh, compressed into the wood box yes there is and no the uh, there is no uh, no no attach no, but the boxes let's say the boxes, are, the boxes they... are attached to the concrete Okay, so they are not self-supporting. They, they don't have their own no, foundation. They, they are. They are also. They are not uh, transporting charge like a, like a column, a concrete column. Okay. But, that, but they are supporting only their own uh, weight. They, uh, they support their own weight. Yes. Okay, so they, they have their own foundation and their own. Uh, are, if you can, if I can show you the the picture or the. Yeah. Growing, maybe we can see. Uh, can see the. This is not. Uh, this, it's only. Um, that, that's a um, prototype. Prototype. But maybe on the concrete. Um, see the boxes. Maybe on the here you can see. Ah, okay. The the wooden box is uh, just uh, fixed on the concrete. It's on the concrete. Okay, so they have their own foundation and then they are attached to the to but the concrete structure. Yeah. But they are they they, do, they don't support the the weight of these. Uh, um, savings or je sais pas comment on dit les dalles. Slab. 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 So the slab are the, the weight of this slab are going into the, the walls. Yes, okay. No, no, that, that was the question. Okay. Okay, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, uh, Thomas, for this presentation. It was uh, it was really great and really a uh, lot of information. And I really hope that uh, people in Turkey, architects and future architects in Turkey can see uh, how it is possible to build with trouble, even on a concrete frame to keep the cost low 
but still using natural material as much as possible as insulation because it's something i was really really wanted to show that because since in turkey the construction is more or less like in france based on uh, concrete structure building and then putting insulation exterior insulation i was just wanted to show that it is also possible to use other material as insulation that rock wool or polystyrene so thanks a lot again for this uh, presentation thomas and uh, i wish you a lot of good projects this year and a lot of uh, nice things for you and all your colleagues and your family thank you have a nice uh, have a good uh, year uh, 2021